It is a scary time for people close to retirement or for anyone who needs to tap into their investments immediately. This after the Dow plummets over 500 points in a single session. Nine News reporter Bryce Onslinger is live in the newsroom now with how that market drop is impacting the average investor. Bryce? Brendan, market experts call what happened on Wall Street today a correction. But what if you don't have time to wait, on a, wait for a rebound on Wall Street? Those are the numbers investors had their eyes on all day. When the final bell rang, the Dow was down 512 points, the steepest fall since the financial crisis of 2008. The Atkins family also had their eyes on the market. We're not panicked, but we feel like we're in a, in a tough spot. The Anderson Township family is getting ready to pay for a major expense, college. Usually we've looked at it as more of a long term, yeah. so we can ride it out, but right now with our daughter heading off to college, we feel like we need to liquidate. The first payment for their daughter's freshman year at Indiana University is due Wednesday. They had planned on tapping into their investments to cover the cost. This egg that we've been putting money into for forever, we, we were ready to tap into, and now we're thinking we can't do that. The Atkins family says they started looking at other options when Congress was arguing over raising the debt ceiling, something they say will help them get through the latest dip in the market. And now it may seem like things can't get any worse, but financial experts will remind you that at this time last year, the Dow was 1,000 points lower than it is today. Brendan? Important point, uh, point Bryce Onslinger with the story tonight. Thanks.